Hi, I'm Mark from the Home Depot Rental Center. When the job calls for medium to heavy duty demolition of concrete, masonry or asphalt surfaces up to 12 inches thick, we offer the Hilti TE3000 Pro Breaker. This breaker can get the job done. It's designed with active vibration reduction, which allows it to deliver high impact energy while reducing operator fatigue. It's best suited to help you in the demolition of concrete slabs, foundations, sidewalks, as well as breaking up asphalt in road building, pipe laying, and repair work. The breaker can also be used in removing concrete for rear and utility connections and excavating and compacting needs. Be aware that the power tool with the transport cart weighs approximately 90 pounds, so the tool should always be carried by two people. When you're ready to operate, remember to always wear approved ear and eye protection, safety gloves, and any other safety gear required. Now there are a few operational safety procedures you need to know before you get ready to use the Pro Breaker. You should only use the tool in a dry environment. Never use the power tool where there is a risk of fire or explosion. The tool may be operated only when connected to a power supply providing a voltage and frequency in compliance with the information given on the ID plate. Finally, be sure to review and observe all information printed in the instructions concerning operation, care, and maintenance. Now to use the Hilti Breaker. Always make sure the tool is disconnected from the power source before changing or inserting the chisel. We recommend a 10 gauge extension cord up to 50 feet in length that's available from your rental associate. Now you're ready to remove the tool from the cart. And remember, you'll need two people for this. Jeff, we ready? Select the appropriate 1 and 1 8 inch hex chisel. Check that the connect end of the chisel is clean and lightly greased. If it's not, clean and grease it. Push the insert tool into the chuck and pivot the retaining bar to locking position. Check that the chisel has engaged correctly by pulling on it. Once you are locked in, you're ready to go. Now connect the detachable power supply cord. Push the keyed releasable electric connector into the socket on the power tool as far as it'll go. Turn the plug connector clockwise until you hear it engage. Now plug the cord into the 10 gauge extension cord and plug that cord into your power source. Now you're ready to begin. Press the on off switch fully. Position the tip of the chisel at the point where chiseling is to begin. You don't need to exert a lot of pressure when using this tool. Just let the tool do the work. Please be aware that aggressively pushing the tool sideways may cause damage or injury. Instead, just place the chisel closer to the breaking edge. When you finish your project, simply unplug the 10 gauge extension cord from the supply cord. To remove the supply cord from the tool, pull the collar back and turn the connector counterclockwise as far as it'll go and pull the connector out of the tool. Be careful when you're ready to remove the chisel as it may still be hot. And never lay it down on any materials that may be flammable as this could cause the material to ignite. Now open the locking bar by pivoting the bar 90 degrees. Then pull the chisel out of the chuck. Prior to returning the tool back to the Home Depot Rental Center, clean all debris on the chisels and breaker and properly secure the cart before transporting to prevent any damage. Visit your local Home Depot or homedepot.com rentals to learn more about the best tools for your next project.